Jcast Productions presents Love Letters by A.R. Gurney. Love Letters is a funny and heartwarming comedy about two friends romantically attached as they write letters to each other over a span of 50 years, starting from grade school. This Broadway smash hit comedy stars Lorenzo Lamas, best known from the TV hits Renegade and Falcon Crest, along with Charlene Tilton, known as Lucy Ewing from the hit series Dallas. Love Letters, coming to a town near you. When it's warmer up, can I come over and swim in your pool? No, you can't. I have a new nurse named Miss Hawthorne who thinks you'll give me infantile paralysis. <laughs> will you help me go down and get milk and cookies during recess? I will, if you don't ask me to marry you again. <laughs> There's a girl here, Annie Abbott, who met him in Edgartown last summer and thinks he's cute. Would you ask him what he thinks of her? Spencer Willis says Annie Abbott is a potential nympho. <laughs> <laughs> Your last letter was too much about rowing. Do you know a boy there named Steve Scully? I met him down in Florida and he said he went to your school and was on the first crew. He said he was the fastest rower in the boat. Is that true or was he lying? I think he may have been lying. Steve Scully was lying. He doesn't even row. And if he did, and he rode faster than everyone else in the same boat, he'd mess the whole thing up. <laughs> he said he got the second base with him. Is that true? Steve Scully is a lying son of a bitch. And you can tell my sister. Do you talk about sex with a psychiatrist? I talk about sex all the time. It's terribly expensive. a letter from New Hampshire. Did you receive it? Are you there? Or are you visiting your grandma? Or what? Are you sore at me? I'll bet you're sore at me. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm a stuffy bastard sometimes, aren't I? The hell with you then. Four-letter words like hell. Screw you! <laughs> Don't you wish you could? <laughs> Merry Christmas from San Antonio. I'm trying the Southwest. I can see the most incredible shapes outside my bedroom window. There's also a pretty incredible shape now sleeping in my bed. <laughs> Season's greetings from the Lab family. Mother wrote you were planning to get married to I was. I did. I'm not now. <laughs> Mother wrote that you won some important election for the Republicans. Oh, I'm terribly disappointed. I love all politicians, but I find Democrats much better than them. I'm a liberal Republican. <laughs> Doesn't that count? Depends on the position. <laughs> Congratulations on baby number two. Number two is a perfect way to describe this particular baby. <laughs> Jane and the boys join me in wishing each and every one of you a happy holiday season. Dear Andy, if I ever get another one of these creepy <laughs> Xerox Christmas letters from you, I think I'll invite myself to your ducky little house for dinner. And when you're all sitting there eating terribly healthy food and discussing terribly important things and generally congratulating yourself on all your accomplishments, I think I'll stand up on my chair and turn around and move the whole fucking thing. <laughs>
If it was just love, we were out in the cold. And if it was all my love, you were hemmed in for life. But much love meant things could go either way, remember? Merry Christmas and love from us all. <laughs>